Uh, any emotions going into that one? I think it's just really exciting, obviously, to have our first match underway. I think the most exciting part is to be in front of fans again, and a lot of them. I think we were told last night that we're expected to break 10,000, so that'll be amazing to just have that fandom behind us and that energy in the building. Has it sunk in, like, the history that a vote is going to be tomorrow? Um, and in some ways, yes, but in some ways, no. I think like there's so much to come that nobody knows exactly where all this will take us, but hopefully it takes us big places fast. From the beginning of January to now, how has the team come together, starting to gel, especially with the finalizing of the roster? Yeah, I couldn't be happier with the group that is here. I think um, all of them are such great volleyball players, but also such great humans, and so that's just been amazing to build those connections and on the court and off the court. Speaking of which, um, also going up against Atlanta. I mean, how much are you guys prepping for them specifically, or is it still like you're just focusing on yourself? I think the coaching staff has a big focus on what we're doing um, against Atlanta and those kind of lineups. But I think at the end of the day, the players are really focused on making sure that we're doing what we can on our side and um, yeah, just sharpening that stuff. So I think it's you know obviously a mix of both. What have you learned from your teammates and coaches over the course of camp and this entire experience to this point? Um, I think that we have had some really intense training days and strung a lot of great practices together. And so I think every day we just come into the gym ready to roll and um, continue to create really strong practice, um, stringing great practices together. Has anything surprised you or been different from what you expected? Um, but like I said, I mean, you never know exactly what the group is going to end up, like what the vibe is going to be, I guess. But like I said, just every girl's been so amazing and I literally love every single one of them. And so um, that, it's just been great to have such great humans behind the player as well and build those connections. It makes it extra fun. That's what it's all about. And I think this is one of the biggest team sports out there. And so that stuff is so important. And every person just brings so much value um, and wisdom, it's not just, again, on the court, but in meetings and things like that and what they have to say with their own experiences. Do you know anything about this Atlanta team coming in tomorrow night? It's a few things. <laughs> yeah, um, I don't know how much of that I'm like putting out there, but yeah. <laughs> yeah. Don't want to give away any strategy. Yeah, but no, I mean, they have amazing players. We've seen a lot of us played against a lot of these players in Athletes Unlimited, and so um, we're familiar with them, and I, it'll be a great matchup. So what moment do you think it'll become real for you, this league and everything? Yeah, so like? First set, when you walk on the court, or? I think getting that energy in the building will be amazing. Um, but like I said, I don't think anybody really knows what the possibilities are, just how far this can, like what this, this is the spark, right? And the fire is going to continue to get bigger, and that's really exciting. So um, it's just uh, amazing to be a part of it and be one of the, I guess, pioneers in it. This is going to be the league's first match. Do you think that maybe uh, this first match will kind of set the tone for the whole league, whatever happens tomorrow night? Hopefully, yeah. I think, um, like I said, it's us going out there and giving our best and focusing on what we're doing on the si our side of the net and, um, you know, want to make sure that we are know the matchups and things like that and what things we can be doing best to line up against them, but also just doing the best we can on our side and focus on what we're doing. Mm -hmm.